All right, guys, let's check our second trap. Ooh, this one feels heavier. This one's still a little small. I'm gonna get the, I'm actually gonna get my measure and measure this one. And just so you know, it's not a measurer, it's a gauge. But this is the gauge. This thing's way too tiny. Let's see, hold on. No, he's a keeper. It's supposed to be five and three quarters. Oh, that's not five and three quarters. So we've got, no, I think he's a keeper. Yeah, this one's a keeper. Yep. So, I got my first keeper. We're gonna go throw this one on ice as soon as uh, I pull up my other trap. Let me pull up that other trap. And I actually, I just looked at this. This is, I don't think this is a Dungeness crab. I think this is one of those black claw crabs or something. I'm gonna have to look at that. But this guy won't let go. So I'm gonna go shake him off over there so I don't lose them. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so that was a keeper crab. It was not a Dungeness crab. That was a, a red rock cra crab, actually. So that's actually this crab right here that I got with the black claws. So this is what I'm after, but I can also uh, keep any of the, any size of the red crab apparently so that's a keeper red rock crab 24 of any size or sex water's open all year 24 hours per day water ocean waters are closed for dungeness crab october 16th to november 30th bay beaches estuaries tide pools piers and jetties are open for crabbing all year so we're good boom got a crab I'm going to get this other one casted out and check the other one in a minute. Now I'm going to check this one. Feels like there's something in it. All right, this one's a Dungeness. Way lighter. Let's see. He's a keeper. awesome it's fun stay tuned for more okay guys so I'm gonna take this bad boy off the trap hopefully he just falls
goes. He's off the trap and he's going right in the cooler. Look at that. It's a nice one. It's two. Let's go get some more. All right, guys. Caught two crabs so far. Now I'm going to cast this one in a different spot. I'm going to come over here a little bit. Cast it out there a little bit. Trying to straighten up the camera a little bit for you guys. All right. So that's the spot I've been trying to get it in. For some reason, when I swing it and I throw it, I'm throwing it across my body and it's always going to the left. I gotta try to figure out how to get it to go straight. So, and plus my elbows have been killing me. So that doesn't help, but it's getting better. I've been working out for the last couple of weeks. So I'm going to pull in this other trap, I'll move that camera, once I tie this down, man I'd like to get a double or something, that'd be really cool. Let's check this one. Take it off the rock, wrap it around my hand. Get in the slack. Got another. This one's too small, I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty sure this one's too small. Not not even close. I should have known that. Cast and wait, cast and wait. I love this, this is so fun. Man, if you guys haven't done crabbing or even seen the ocean or whatever, man, I highly recommend it. It's beautiful out here, it's fun. I love it, stay tuned. All right guys, it's time to check the other trap. You really don't want to leave the traps in there too long because then the crabs start taking the bait.
That was a good toss. Pull this one real quick because that went in the same area. Ooh, this one feels big. Two red crab and one dungeness. The dungeness is too small. Alright guys, so far I have three red crab and one dungeness crab. I'm gonna cast this out again and check the other one. I hit the rock right when I went to toss it. Looks like it's okay. Oh, that one keeps going upside down. Anyways, take this one off and check it, and add that one. Another dungeness, but it's too small. And I did a terrible job pulling up this trap. Okay. I don't know what that did to the other trap, but I'm not even going to mess with it. I'm just going to leave it out there anyway. real easy getting these knots out. Don't get discouraged. It's real simple. Just look at it for a second and fix it. It's got loops intertwined. Take those loops out. Those loops cause havoc. Don't try to pull them tight. Let's recast this one. Alright guys, we're going to wait five minutes and we'll check both these traps. Hey, do me a favor. If you guys like these videos, man, or have any suggestions, let me know. Also, hit that subscribe button right up here. And then uh, also like the videos, man. Hit somewhere up here. I'm going to put one right here. Like the video. Well, you can't hit that button and like it, but you get what I'm saying. Just pause it. Like it. Come back to the video. See what else is going on. Thank you. Appreciate it. Feels heavy. <coughs> I got oh, one. yay, look. This one. I left it in there way too long and started eating the meat. See oh, that? that's a nice size. That's little. <coughs> Here, grab it for me. Looks like dinner to me. Just grab the whole trap. Yeah, yeah, yeah you don't have to worry. Just pull it. Take it. Take it with you. I'm trying. Okay, I just want to let you know you're okay. The rope, don't worry about the rope. Let's go set it on the, the edge of the tarp. Go this way. 
Oh, it fell off. That's okay. Come bring the trap back. Just step over him. He ain't going to do nothing to you. Just set it right there. Thank you, baby. If you grab it by the back leg, you could throw it in the cooler. They can't get you by anything if you grab it from the back leg. It won't hurt you, I promise. Take pictures of it if you want. All right, guys, sorry. I'm going to roll this up real quick. Oh, my quick. gosh, it's moving quick. Try and get away from you. Yes, sick. Honey, hurry up so you can get it. I got to pull the other trap in. Just one, a dungeoness. Oh, I let go. It's getting away. It was a big one. Oh, no. Look at how huge that was. Holy shit. I'm throwing this back in there. He got away. Sorry. It was huge. Really? Yeah. That's so cool. Oh, got the water boiling for the coffee. Got our little critter. Ready to attack. Well, you just go like this, babe. These legs back here, you can just grab them from anywhere. They can, they'll stab into you, but it don't hurt. See? But the better way to grab them is actually to grab them by the legs like this. Oh, you know? oh, oh I just broke that one. But look at these. What? <laughs> Pretty slick, right? So important, let's see. And I'll pour it on your hand first. Ow, take pleasure. I'll tell you what, before I start working out, before we get working out, I'm not guilty of the spot. I promise you that. That's just a, I reached out to you on the back. I just right on the back. It's pretty easy. This makes the best coffee, I'll tell you what. Exclusive this, makes the nice coffee, I'll tell you what. Where are they? Show me. <laughs> Come on, baby. And you know what? Something like this, you're not going to do in your apartment, downtown Grand Rapids, because you're too busy. What are you gonna do? You're gonna use a coffee maker. No. We got so much time. It's beautiful doing this. It's relaxing. I'm scared. <laughs> That's cool, right? You should post that on uh, Morales out or uh, yours and Morales out <clears throat> or uh, whatever. You, no, you can't on Morales out. Yeah. But uh, post it on. Uh, your page and say crabbing video coming to Morales Outdoors. Stay tuned. YouTube only. And we're just going to let that continue to drip and serve it. Hey, thanks for watching. What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm going to show you guys what we got here. Last time, I was having trouble with the camera in the beginning of the first few, so I'm gonna do a little intro here, let you guys know what I'm using. Just a $5.99 bag of chicken. And this is what we got.
dinner for tonight. Be prepared. <laughs>